Yeah, yo, what's going on guys? Seth Spartan here. Guys, we are back today with a video that you don't want to miss. Boom. Just hit some good biceps. And today we're going to be talking about what? We're going to be comparing bench press. My bench press, my performance, natural, to TRT, and to steroids. Granted, I've already talked about this in uh, the video, Anabolic Steroids, The Truth, all the negatives that came from uh, me personally using anabolic steroids. So do not use anabolic steroids. In my case, you know, I was getting everything from the pharmacy with a prescription. So it was a hundred percent, a hundred percent real as, and as good as it gets. Having said that, no matter what country you live in or, you know, what's going on, legal, illegal, don't use anabolic steroids, or you're going to run into issues. Again, go watch my video. Anabolic, this, uh, anabolic steroids, the truth, if you want everything related to that. Having said all that, guys, this is where we're at, and this is the point of this video, which is what? Natural. Me, naturally, 19 years old, bench press, 400 pounds. I was naturally able to bench press with nothing, no hormones, no nothing. Naturally, my best was about, yeah, my best was a little bit over a 400 pound bench press natural, 19 years old, all right? So that shows the genetics and that shows, you know, where I was at. Having said that, anabolic steroids, when I had a prescription for anabolic steroids from the pharmacy, you know, uh, Deanabol, Anavar, and they were able to do this uh, as part of my hormone replacement regimen at the time, okay? This is quite a long time ago, but anyways, so on anabolic steroids, guess what? I was able to bench press 500, okay? I was able to do a 500-pound bench press. You know, I did something crazy like um, I was able to do, what was it, like 365, like 12 times or something crazy. I was able to incline bench press. The best incline bench press I ever did was, uh, well, let's see, three plates and a 35. What is that? I, I just count by plates now. I don't really count by math, but I did... I did um, Three plates and a 35, that is 385. I was able to do that, I think it was six times, okay? So I, I was yoked, yoked to the definition of the word yoked and jacked, all right? So having said that, um, that's what I was able to do naturally as well as on anabolic steroids. Again, don't use anabolic steroids. Go watch my video, uh, Anabolic Steroids, the truth for all the negatives, okay? Regardless where you live in the world, um, having said that, TRT, let's talk about TRT real quick and the video's over. What was I able to do on TRT? On TRT, testosterone replacement therapy, my best in full bulk mode, full bulk mode, getting my weight up around 240, 440 pounds bench press on high dose TRT and HGH replacement, okay? To the top of the range, slightly over, as I talked about. And that's, you know, that's what I'm doing now, testosterone and HGH replacement uh, through the clinic I work for. So having said that, let's, let's list the numbers real quick. And guess what? Boom, boom, this video's over. So naturally, 19 years old, best I could ever do was right about 400, slightly over, but we'll just say 400 to be on the safe side. Uh, TRT, right about 440, 440 bench press, absolute best. And then on anabolic steroids, 500. So you guys, this gives you guys, uh, you know, for the people that are curious, this, this gives you a very clear, obvious, um, I don't want to say example. Well, I guess it is, but this gives you a clear cut picture. There we go. This gives you a clear cut picture of the differences um, between the three. Natural, TRT, and steroids, what a person expects. Just putting this dead out for you, black and white. So you know just about how much gain and how much difference there actually is. Guys, Seth Spartan, stay safe, stay healthy. God only gave you one body. Take care of it. And we are out of here. Boom.